The drive-in. I want to talk about that. Okay. So this one's unique. Yes. Because it's it, like a theater, but outside and with your yes. car. Basically, they don't provide any of the seats or any, or the sound. Yeah, no, no seats. That. There is food. It, well, it depends on which one you go to, but they, they usually do provide food as well, which is awesome. Yeah. My um, sister worked at um, the drive-in by us, Harris. People call it Harris, but it's actually I, Harris drive-in. I wasn't really a drive-in guy, not going to lie. Really? Like, I you guys come up. Not I didn't really go, eh. One, the sound's terrible. The projection's not the best. It, depend, it depends largely on when you're going to go see it, right? Yeah, like, it's very it, like, weather-dependent and, like, season-dependent. Yeah. That's one of the cons. But I, I personally, we'll talk about the pros and cons. I personally just overall really like drive-ins. I think, honestly, it might be one of my favorite movie-going experiences just because it's so rare that I go. And when I do, it's like an, I go, like, as an event, like, with friends. I don't know. I really just enjoy the drive-in. So you, But you personally don't like it. Not really, not really. I mean, it depends. I haven't really seen. I've only been to the driving like once or twice. It's the thing. What are the movies you saw? Uh, I'm pretty sure once was Grease with you. I don't think I saw Grease the drive-in. Maybe with Liz. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I forget, but like it was, it was okay. Movie experience wasn't the best. Nah, dude, driving's just and actually then, my favorite. <laughs> and it just doesn't hit for me. Like it just doesn't. Like on top of like not only like trying to compete sound wise, like. With the speakers on the front that are like relatively weak compared to like all the ambient sound as well. It's just, yeah, so the way eh. our drive, drive-in works, you can either play the sound by tuning into a radio station on your car or by getting a radio that you can like rent from the front office, which that also I think in itself, if you choose to use your car, that always gave me stress. I was worried my car battery was going to die because you get like you play two movies when you go to the drive-in. It's also cheaper, I think, than going to the actual movies because you get like two in one but i was always worried that like my car was gonna die so between movies i'd like turn on my car like recharge my battery a bit but that being said i just love the experience like you get to like just chill and like bring lawn chairs and relax like lay down in your car with your friends or if you're going like with a date it's just a lot of fun i feel like if we went more with the guys i would have had more fun especially if we like had drinks or something like that i haven't gone since i've been 21 except once but i was with a girl i don't know i i really liked it i, I think i went once with tyler our friends tyler and aaron but it was mm-hmm. after i worked at fedex in the morning back a couple years <laughs> ago i used to work at fedex so i would i worked 4 30 in the morning to like nine like eight or nine in the morning then i stayed up all day and then i went to the drive-in at night and i for some reason decided to drive and so by the time we were going home after seeing two movies after the sunset it was like 2 a.m and so I had almost been up for 24 hours, and I was just like, I should not Dead. have driven home, honestly. It was like I was drunk at the drive-in, but bad. So <laughs> I was so tired. Um, yeah, but my sister worked at the drive-in, and she really likes it, and I think she also likes the experience. She um, worked the concessions and just helped out just in general. But the, the food there was, like, I think, also different. Like, you had your popcorn, but I think at Harris, you had, like, pickles on a stick and stuff. And it was just, like, more mm. unique food, and you can kind of... It was more unique, don't get me wrong there. Like, it looked, it looked more variety, which is always cool. Yeah. But, like, pickle on a stick, all right? But there was, like, like, like nachos, hot dogs. Like, yeah, like, you don't get that stuff at, like, a regular theater. So that is a plus. That was a huge plus. Also, if you try to eat nachos in a theater... Yeah, that's true. I think because you have your own space in your car, that's, like, you can do more... You have more freedom of, like, what you want. Like, it's a hybrid, almost, of, like, you're not as, like, prim and proper as, like, in a movie theater, like, with the etiquette. Yeah. But, like... You're also still more focused because you like chose to go there that you're not like as distracted as like at home. So I think that's a good balance there. Some more pros before we get into the cons. But the pros, I think it's really fun when you get there early and like before the, because it goes on live when the sun sets. Like before the sun sets, like there's a lot of space. And then when I went to and like you could toss frisbee with your friends and like there's like a playground. You just like walk around, run around. If you if you sometimes you'd see people you know there. I think that part was really fun. Make me want to do it now. Dude, I love the drive-in. And also, also, I know I've talked about this in the past, but I just want to reiterate because this is like an episode focused on this. But my perception of movies depends like very heavily on like where I'm seeing the movie at. Like, for example, if I see the movie theater, I love the movie. If I see it, as we'll talk about, on a plane, I hate it. But like the driving, because that's like my top – I think that's my top choice for movie going. Mm-hmm. That's like – peak for me like i saw i think planet of the apes like an okay one i was like that was great and i saw the emoji movie and i was like that wasn't half bad like i think it's just because i (laughs) I love being at the drive-in and like the atmosphere of it like just really skews my perception so now every time i go to a movie there i have to like really think like was this a good movie or do i just love going to the (laughs) drive-in 